Yeah, yeah, I just, I just started. You can, you can also check to see how long the recording's been going on, oh, the, on, the, on top. the timer up top. Yeah, yeah, so, so there's so, a new one, there's a new one. Yeah, so that way, in case you're ever wondering, you started a fresh one. Good enough. Okay, so we are almost done. Uh, loser semis. Lots of uh, lots of team kills today. Uh, there, oh, were yeah. lot, there were a lot of null, a lot of age. Definitely seems to me that uh, they are the two most active crews overall at the moment. Their HRG's got probably had to go back to work a little bit, unfortunately, as in GSM. So, yeah, well, th those crews are much older, as is like the older faction, obviously. True. So you know, real real life does take priority. Yeah, I would do that. I'm not even that old. <laughs> I think I'm working. Too much. Anyway, nah, man, you gotta work now, man. There's, there'll be plenty of time to sleep when when you're retired. That's true. Yeah. You gotta get in that work now while you're young. You can do it. Anyway, okay. so. Okay. Town and City start. We're gonna see the Joker once again. Casey, sorry, Altair only using the uh, Young Lincoln one matchup today. So, we'll probably see. Unless see unless something goes horribly wrong in this game, we'll probably see Joker all set. I don't think we ever see like FD starts or Battlefield starts too much these days anymore. No. It's almost always town PS2 or Smash. There was that there was that thread on Twitter I linked um, a while back that had a pretty good analysis on that and uh, honestly like the, what, what the person suggested I think is totally like good. But we can talk about that Ooh. later. I I also know that Japan has started to play with hazards on again. Yeah. So on top C especially. Yeah. So obviously they don't get access to PS2 anymore. Oh, oh no. my. Jesus. Oh, he's looking at his controller. Not sure what happened there. Oops. That's a that's a tough stock to lose, but. King, King is no stranger to this. He's a veteran. So. Yeah, Casey said we can take those. I got our set still. Oh, yeah, yeah, yes. Yeah. He, he is steamrolling this right now. He's all over him. Definitely getting a lot of value out of that SD. Racking up almost 70% so far. Good patience from Alt uh, Altair there. He's, he's not biting. That was good tracking. It's just, again, it's zero suits kind of hard to punish in that situation. So there's just, there wasn't really anything there. Yeah, and Joker is just as slippery as ZSS, so not very easy to hit. Oh, great little gun there to, yeah. to cut off the jump. Put a, put a bullet in her tits and told her to get the fuck down. Oh, oh, out, oh get <laughs> off me. <laughs> so Slifer Red doing very well right now. Slifer. Oh, but that was good. All right, so King finally taking out that stock, but Altair's on a roll right now. We'll see if we'll see if King can come up with something to stop his momentum. Yes, yeah, oh, that's a great little two-piece there. Nair up smash. Oh, no tech, but he's gonna get the hell out of there. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh. Sorry, the push. That's interesting. Air dodge got there. Our well, it was air dodge. But yeah, so now now King needs to kind of chill until the Arsene goes away if he can stay alive, because uh, now he can't take trades anymore. Arsene hit, hits way too hard. Yeah. Yep. <laughs> uh, unsafe F tilt on shield. That, that move has always been kind of unsafe. It, it's quick, though. Nice. Good little combo there. King immediately busting out with the four there. Good use of the back there. He just put out that Zare, or not that Zare, that side B there to try to cover an uh, early jump in, but KC. It might have been an ill advised drift in there. Oh. oh. That's one of those situations, I think, where you kind of have to think about positioning uh, and, like, where you don't ever want to be to die. And being on the ledge, facing outward against ZSS is uh, definitely one of those uh, times where it's like, okay, let's not be there <laughs> so that I can extend my stock uh, properly. This has been a very fast-paced game, and uh, I would say both players are kind of liking it, but it's also kind of favored King I definitely think his it favors, comeback. I definitely think it favors King more uh, yeah. just because of King's reactions and uh, his, his neutral. Oh, he had a chance there, but uh, pulled the trigger a bit too early with that dash attack. That was cool. Uh, landing up there, there. It's pretty spicy. Arsene is almost gone. Uh oh. Okay, good, good fade back. He saved, he saved his screw up, but Arsene's gonna disappear here. He's gonna have to figure out how to close this out without his yeah, big boy. It's very unlikely that he'll get another one unless he gets like a big rebels guard. He'll, yeah, he'll have to read a rebels guard if he wants it again. And I don't know if it's worth it at this percent to go for that, unless you have a really good call out. There's enough time for it to appear naturally, but it's going to take way, way too long. 
Oh, that gun almost got punished. He tried to sniff out King's recovery with the back air. That's not gonna kill. Game, please. We know better than this. Although, it would've been interesting to see if Altair had gone for three or four pummels. Would that have actually been enough? I think, I think it might have been close. Just because of the positioning. Oh, oh, oh. oh my god, both people shooting each other. Oh, he tried to anti-air him and there there's the a rebel guard! guard. <laughs> That's exactly what we said. Ah! And it wins him the game. <laughs> Speak oh, the of one. the devil. And Satan said, I'm back. <laughs> <laughs> you thought there wasn't enough time, but I'm back. Oh, we said it would take a really good call out, and he got a really good call out. Yep, hold that donkey kick. <laughs> no, good way to close out that game for Altair as he goes up 1-0 in this set. <clears throat> so now King with his back to the wall. That SD obviously did him no favors, but he did catch up very, very well. Yep. Brought it down to the wire. He's gonna run it back to Town City. Yep. He's sticking with his ESS. And you can really see like just how, how the, the neutral is kind of evened out because both characters just hard to hit. Yeah. Both characters have the ability to kill each other with their back airs or whatever, but know, they're just small, they're skinny. It's tough. They both move very quickly too. They're very agile characters. Yeah, very, very hard to catch them in their movement sometimes. Yeah, it's it's been a very back and, it was a very back and forth game one. It's probably gonna be uh the same here in game two, but we'll see if one of these guys snowballs the other one. Oh that lift? Okay. Surprising. Maybe it's just the space. Nice. And there's the early stock, the good old smash four. That time the DI and the spacing, everything was perfect. Lined up straight for the yeah. spike and box. It's hard to DI that too because it's it just happened so quickly. Yep, that's what makes it so potent. Yeah. Yeah, there's a lot of combos in this game that aren't actually true combos, but they work so consistently because you just, you just can't DI. I'm pretty sure that was true, though, at that, at that range. It, it looks true. Yeah, but I, I think maybe he might have been able to DI and avoid the spike. Yeah. Oh, interesting. King didn't hold down uh, for the final hit, but he gets, like, four up there for it. So. Five. Sick. So cool. <laughs> Another one? So it's, <laughs> needless to say, it's working out. I mean, it, that was actually perfect because all those up airs killed our set. Whee! Oh, he almost did not that DI that back though. <laughs> yeah, he, there was not a lot of uh, upwards DI on that. That's no jump. Oh, but the we, air dodge. But we ZSS, we yeah. always have a jump. <laughs> Somehow, some way. Got that side B, that down B jump. I'll tell you right now, he's trying to make this back, but. Because he, he probably knows he's not going to have Arce head to close out this stock. But if he can kill uh, King here, he'll probably get it back. Uh, what is that smash out? Should be fast enough or is it too slow? From that range, it might have whiffed. That up, up smash can be kind of kind of finicky. I but guess it's true he did not have Arce. So without Arce, it might not have reached. Just harassing him with bullets, but damage doesn't really mean mu much for Altair right now. King needs to uh, choose his hits very carefully though oh. because he does not want to activate Arce. And they get punished right afterwards. Oh, there's the berry. Not five. Buried alive. I mean, they didn't even get our set. Would not have mattered there. He was, he was just dead to the upside. The king, uh, king is grooving right now. Definitely making up for the last game. But there's still another game to play after this now because of the uh, first game. So KC definitely not out of it yet. Oh. Gimp, that's a good start. 200%. <laughs> yeah, I don't think you can win by gimping him at 200%, though. <laughs> True. Oh, in the middle of the up smash. Oh, ah. he screwed up his combo. It looked like he wanted the pop up and not the drag down. Yeah. Uh, since he buffered the other piece. Well, he's gonna have Arsene here. Ideally, you want a very oh, quick King, stock. King drop shield. So that was kind of scary. If you can get a very quick stock here, this could uh, really change the tide of this battle and give Altera a chance to close this out now. But Arsene's gonna expire right here. Yeah, and he. He was uh, not willing to gamble on the ledge there or go for a reaction. Yeah. Sometimes with a game to play, it might be worth it, but unfortunately, he didn't. So. I think if he can get this stock off, I think the next stock will be the time to gamble. Oh. But I think he should definitely try to 
get rid of the stock uh, the old-fashioned way first. Oh, late grab. But does not get killed for it. Still hanging in there. Nice use of the gun to come down on him. It's going to be a question, though. Like, how is he going to get this kill? Oh, oh. that was it. Ah. Yeah, Casey was kind of reacting more towards getting the down tilt off than oh, oh, we're coming spot dodge. Then okay. reacting to the miss grab where he could have smashed him. Yeah. Oof. All right, that's going to tie us at one at least. Mm -hmm. Both the players with a game to go. And the wiener of this will go on to fight uh, small left. <coughs> that would be in losers. Fine. Losers finals, yeah. That would be a best of And I know, I know, I know that I've seen, uh, we've seen King and Small Left fight each other before. I'm actually kind of curious as to how Altair would fight that matchup. Um, they put, he's played it before. He's played him before. Right, right. Um, all I remember from him was down air, down air, down air. <laughs> well, the thing is, uh, I, I don't, I don't know if he's played him recently. I thought he did Joker put with him once before. I'm not too sure though. Oh. Oh, he. What is King feeling right now? Well, it's Casey Counter. Oh yeah, what is? I, I'm sorry. I tell you, what, 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 what bands is King feeling? Oh. Um, uh, so that's gonna determine a lot. That's like he bans natural. Based on what his rip lips said. I'm thinking Kalos would be the Kalos open. I think that would be good for big for open stage. Well, the the the, pla the platforms are great for um, our send back air pressure. Yeah. So it looks like Pokemon C and Two is the pick. Okay. I'm not sure what the bands were. I th I think one of them was Smash Bros, but I'm not entirely sure. Okay, so Casey will go to Pokemon C and Two. That's kind of a more of a neutral stage, so there might have been some pretty good bands on King's part. He's thinking about Young Link. Yeah, I don't know why he's not walking in Joker. He's, he's thinking about it a little bit. Okay, he's gonna go back to Joker. No, yeah. I, I I think this is better. Honestly, I, I, I think this is. This is I agree. I don't I don't think we should be going to Young Link. I think his Joker is so warm at this point. <coughs> I think switching characters might be detrimental. All right, here we go. His Joker is not doing bad. Plus, at fourth place, you can't you're like this is this is pretty successful match right already. Mm -hmm. Definitely above average. Held down his seating and then some. Here we go. Both players gonna try to outshmoove each other one more time to get to the promised land that is in the money. Yeah. Let's grab off that down air. Oh, I don't know if that backer was what he wanted. Maybe it was to send him uh, horizontally. But yeah, uh, Altair is really keeping up with uh, King CSS. He's doing a really good job this set. But here it comes. This could be the turning oh, that's point. Oh, but he missed. Oh, but it was not a re-grab, though, so he couldn't spike him. But that's good, though. This is all good. Well, it was all good until he lost stage control. Uh, there's still half a percent left, and he just got the kill, too. Oh, baby. A really good start for Ars uh, for, sorry, for Arsene, <laughs> for Altair on this stage. Mm. Good punish. That, that's a smart punish because uh, you don't have to commit to anything. You that dark magic. And you get, like, good damage, too. Really good damage on. He might not ha get Arsene again this stock, but you never know. He could definitely still get Arsene with a Rebel's Guard. Good punish here. Altair on the verge of uh, putting down King and getting to top three. Well, I mean, let's not get ahead of ourselves. There's still a whole lot, lot of game left. There is, but he's got the advantage for the time being. For the time being, yes. And, uh, and uh, Arsene can be very snowball-y, so again, if he does get a Rebel's Guard off, that could be... He might not even need the Rebel's Guard at this point. He's racked up so could much could be damage. the exclamation point that he needs. Well, let's King, see. King has also struggled to edge ride him, too. Well, I mean, it's, it's tough because CSS can't really go off stage. <gasps> oh, he thought he thought he hit the Rebel's Guard. Yeah, I think he was trying to get away from, from a potential Arsene. Yeah. Hearing. But luckily, there was enough hit stun on it because his percent was so high, he still got the back. Okay, so he does clean that up. He boost kicks back. That's smart because the invincibility goes through the gun. Oh, he let go! Mm. Actually, he looks puzzled. I wonder... There, no, there's no way that's breaking it. it he's got to be letting go. No, you can't. You can't really break it. Yeah, yeah. That thing beats smashes. So I highly doubt that he... It's twice now. He, he's probably bailing early because he's just like, okay, he's in here. Yeah, you really see that King is be. Oh, my God! That's such a huge uh, turning of the tables. Yeah, King was being so careful there because he knew the gauge was almost full. So he really picked his approaches carefully. That there. was like the most optimal defuse of Arsene ever because like, 
he killed him immediately when I interfered. Now he doesn't have, doesn't have it at all. Yeah, very calculating there. Approaching but, with the Zare and getting the, the combo. But fortunately for Altair, he is right at death percent, and he calls out the shield drop. Probably trying to jump or move or something. That's a oh, that, I thought no, that he was, was invincible. He was invincible. Yeah, still invincible, so it did not matter. Oh yeah, those frame one jabs. Puts a bullet in here though. Oh, catches him air dodging. Oh, he got Arsendo. He ha got the Rebels Guard just in time. If, if you're king here, do you time this out and I, just wait? I think so because... What? Mm. Yeah, I think so because he can't kill you unless he gets like oh, he, four He, he, he can definitely hits. kill you. He can definitely kill you. Well, he yeah. needs like four good hits before you're like in real trouble. So I think it's worth timing out. You should definitely slow it down, I think. Okay, good, yeah, he's, he's just kind of... He's just kind of out zoning him right now. But, but, but King King could go in. Like he could just explode on him too. So he does have options. Yeah. So King King does opt to defuse it. I agree with that. But now comes the question: What 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 happens now? The, the sets act. The, the momentum's actually kind of neutral right now. Oh, he lets go of our set again. He's gonna be off stage. And yeah, King's just gonna take a poke, see what's gonna what's the option Altair's gonna go for. But Altair's going low every time because that's like the safest way to get back. That in. Good gun stall, able to get through. Back at center stage. Altair just holding center stage. Keep an eye on that Arsene meter. He's probably playing for it, because that, that's just, that's probably his win condition right now. And King, I don't know if King's gonna have a reliable way to finish him off, but he's probably gonna fish for something. Only problem is in like 10 seconds, it's gonna come on. <gasps> that was so close. Oh, but this could be Altair's game. Wait for the tag. Back the air. jump! Oh, but that's the secret second jump. Oh, yeah, he's getting out. Yeah, King, King, King backing out because he knows that Arsene could bust out. He, he tried the combo. Oh, no, that's so bad. Oh! That's, I think King made a big mistake. It. Yeah. That is it. I think, I don't, know, I don't know what King said, but yeah, he, yeah. he, he, um. I don't, I don't know if he tried to up be out of shield and jump by accident or something. I, I don't know. It, or his finger slipped and he tried to up air or something. But Casey definitely does not look happy about that win. Yeah, there was something spaghetti that happened.